Welcome back to Bloodborne. We are going to fight what is almost certainly a boss. It's very unlikely that it's not a boss. If it is not a boss, we will be disappointed. Because we went out of our way to be as high level as possible. Maximum power. The best blood gems we have. We're carrying around almost nothing, so there's nothing to lose if we die. The game's gonna screw with you. It's gonna be like a tiny kitten. A blood kitten. Fluffy nightmare of blood. Something like that. <laughs> Ah, there it is. See? Creepy lady crying into a room. And we take this. Up. And, see? Hall full of corpses. No way that this doesn't lead to a boss. Oh, jeez. That looks like fun. Ooh, and there's several doorways. Oh, did you see that? There's a little baby carriage. With the baby crying, yeah. And it looks like it just got eaten by whatever this is. Oh, jeez. It's covered in swords. Ow. Okay, that... Oh, all right. Well, okay. then. But, now we know it's called Murgo's Wet Nurse. And it's covered in swords. I'm gonna assume Murgo's the baby. And the wet nurse just ate the baby. That's what it looked like. See, but this is why... This is why we're carrying around almost nothing. We don't need to worry about getting our body back. Only thing we need to worry about is just... Maybe it took the baby from that lady. Oh, from she this lady? She's bleeding down the front. Oh. I, I guess that would make sense. So maybe we're helping her out by beating this person. Although, if her baby had been stolen, you think she would have something to say. Maybe something along the lines of, help, help. save my baby. Yeah. A giant purple monster stole my baby. How are you supposed to... Oh, I probably should have dodged the other direction. Hey, but I did a thousand damage. Ouch. Okay, so... Right now, I'm going to say this person doesn't seem so bad. Oh. Uh... <laughs> okay. Maybe move. Oh, 
Oh, look, there's two of them now. Oh. Okay, one of them disappeared. Oh, jeez. Aha, there's many of them. I thought that one I was hitting was... So are these clones, or... So that one that I was hitting was the real one. That would explain why it took damage. Oh! <laughs> I dodged completely around into the attack as it wrapped around her body. Take that. And that. And that. She's half dead. Almost. Oh, she's doing the purple thing again, isn't she? No. No. She teleported? I don't mind the teleporting. Purple thing, however, I don't like. Oh, do you know what she makes me think of? You know in the animated movies when there's like the octopus oh. shafts? <laughs> That's what... Oh, look, watch this. Chop, 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 chop. Look how fast I can make sushi. Not to make light of the multi-armed nightmare, but that's what it makes me think of. Uh oh. And that's it, but we're hitting it. Come on, one more. Cool. Okay. And... Well, I think it's because she cast the spell. It's not over yet. Might as well pick up your souls. Your echoes. Echoes. Nightmare slain. Wow. That's different. Why did it say that? You know what? If that was what was holding together all of this, whatever Murgo is... That might be what Nightmare Slain means. That means that we might have actually ended whatever's going on. None of those door. I'm gonna go back and look at the lady. Did you get anything besides the souls? Uh, yeah, I got the one third of umbilical cord. Okay. Oh. Alright. So she, like, bowed and disappeared. That is super weird. So now what? Um... I don't know, but we might as well go back and level up. Oh, crap. Uh, well, maybe you shouldn't have done that. Um, okay, doll, please help. Good hunter. You have come. Yeah, why is everything on fire? Soon break. This night and this dream will end. Gammon awaits you at the foot of the great tree. Very well. What is, what is she talking about? 
I, I'd like to know why the house was on fire. Furthermore, why is it on fire and all of our stuff is still accessible? How many bullet? How many of the bullets did you end up having? <laughs> Only 349. So I okay. wonder if that but gate's she open said now. that dawn will still break. I mean, Ooh. dawn will soon break. And you remember how when we advanced in the story, it went from being like a twilightish to being actually night to being the red moon. You know, he might be in the cemetery area. The yeah, that's or it could be like you said at through that gate at the lower end. So I've got a feeling that we're going to have to talk to him and it will advance the day to the next stage. And then we'll probably just be going right back out into the world with the sun coming up. Yeah, it's open. Well, this seems concerning. Yeah, this doesn't look like a friendly area. Oh, uh, there's not people on them. Okay, they're just little teas. Yeah, so she said dawn. Dawn will break, so I'm pretty sure, like I said. Next stage. Yeah, and I will go talk to him. Because dawn breaking has to be good. Okay, Garriman. Good hunter. You've done well. The night is near its end. Now, I will show you mercy. Uh. You will die, forget the dream, and awake under the morning sun. You will be freed from this terrible hunter's dream. Okay. Yeah. Because he said that we would wake up, right? Yeah. Suggesting that maybe none of this is real. Farewell, my keen hunter. Fear the blood. And if this was something bad, I don't think he'd be nearly so nice about it. Oh, he's gonna shoot you in the back of the head, isn't he? Uh-oh. No, we are getting... Look at that. We are going to get scythed. Garman's pretty tall. Okay, so he just killed me. Which I cannot help but feel is not a good development. But you said you'd wake up. Yep, there. Uh, look, I've got a head again, so that's an improvement. We are in. This looks like the cathedral ward. And that looks this like the sun. This actually seems like the end of the game. But. Look, there's the sun. Farewell, good hunter. May you find your worth in the waking world. Okay, that's kind of creepy. That's what she's been saying the entire game. Okay, so that was it. Yeah, that was it. I'm not sure if that's a good ending or not, because we got killed, which seems bad, but the sun came up, which seems good. The house isn't on fire anymore, which 
also good. The house looked like it was still on fire. No, not, was in, the, it? not in the background. Not when no? the oh. doll was praying for us. So why would we have a gravestone there if that's not the real world? Like, like that's what I'm not sure of. I'm not sure if this counts as good or bad. Ah, there we go. There is a skip button. This can bring you back to the home screen. Either that, or we're gonna wake back up in the hunter's dream, and Garman's gonna be all like, ha 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 ha, and then he's just gonna wheel away. <laughs> Sure fooled you, didn't I? Or we are actually going to be in the town with the lights on. But given that they rolled the credits... All signed and sealed. Now, let's begin the transfusion. This is 100% the beginning of the game. Whatever happens, you may think it all a mere bad. I remember this. This takes us to the character creator. So it's possible that this isn't the end and we're going to wake back up and something's going to be different. It's just an unending cycle. Yep. It's like, would you like to wake up? And then you wake up and you're here. Would you like to wake up? And then you're here again. And then we're gonna meet the messengers. We still haven't decided if they're terrifying or cute. I think they're cute. Would you cuddle with one? You found yourself a hunter. And look at me. Oh, jeez. Yeah. You still have all of your echoes and everything. Got all of your echoes. You've got all of the equipment. So it's new game plus. Let's... Seek pale blood to transcend the hunt. Yeah, I previously thought the pale blood was me, but I've got a feeling it's not. I don't think we met anyone with pale blood. Yeah, look at this. Everything is exactly the way it was at the beginning of the game. So I don't think waking up meant much. Oh, then you're going to come down here and it's not going to mean anything because you already have... Oh, we are just going to be able to tear through the beginning of the game. I mean, I hope so. And all the items are back. Have all the doors reset, though? Yes, they have. Man. The world is 100% just like we left it. In the worst possible way. And the sun's not even up. Central Yarnum. Uh, but instead of it being mysterious like it was, we know... Well, I don't want to say that we know all of its secrets, but we've got a pretty good idea of what to expect. Oh, wow. So they must have more health. Oh, yeah, see, because that guy gave 900, nearly.
so I'm not even sure what we should do or say here yeah. because like we could just keep on playing the game and finish it a second <laughs> time, finish it a third time, finish it a fourth time. But I think it's uh a very first lamp. Gilbert's not dead. Yeah, I'll talk to him. We'll go back to the hunter's dream. And I'm Gilbert. Yeah. It'd be really cool if he if you on new game plus if you like said something. Why'd you kill me? Something like that. Something about you sounding familiar. Looking familiar. Smelling. One of those. You taste familiar. Yeah. Because we, we could play the game another time. So we'll just look around here, see if anything's any different. Did it play this the first time we showed up? Uh, I think it did. But then again, that's after you've been killed in the clinic. So that's why you're on the ground. And I didn't need to get killed in order to get here. Not this time. So here we are. None of these go anywhere anymore. That's all I have. Doll doesn't do anything. Even though I have 99 insight. <laughs> but, look, I can buy everything. Everything I was able to buy before. Okay. The chalice is still in place. Good. In the insight store. <laughs> Oh, look. I can buy a blood rock. I'm not sure if I want to, but I could. And there's the guy that killed me. Let's see if he has anything to say. Ah, you must be the new hunter. Well, I am... Oh, you're sure to be in a... F just... You know. Yeah. That's exactly what he would have said before. All right, well. Wow. Where's a nice dramatic? Here we go. Here, here's a dramatic place to stay. All right, let's. There we go. So. I think it's fair to say that this has been Bloodborne. You've seen all of it, pretty much. There well, were you, we didn't go back and kill the bosses. Ah, yeah, there were several. I don't think we areas. knew it was gonna end. Yeah, I mean, we we didn't. I just assumed it would be the next step of the story, and then we'd be right back out in the world. Well, I hope you don't hold us not finishing those few areas against us. We will not be done with Bloodborne because there's still the old hunters which we'll get that and then we'll play through that not now as it'll be some separate thing that we'll do near future-ish. Do we have anything else that needs to be said about Bloodborne? We're gonna play on Twitch. Yeah. You know that's probably what we're gonna do. We'll start over with a new character on Twitch. Race through it race through it as fast as you can with a brand new character that has no idea what they're doing. <laughs> Although, they will have an idea what they're doing because we've already played through it. So, there should be less mistakes at least. Well, you would hope. So, we have other games that you can see on our YouTube channel. We have unboxings and various other things of that nature. You are, of course, welcome to subscribe and like and share everything with all of your friends, or you can keep it to yourself if you're a selfish type. We wouldn't hold it against you. We are a rare treasure. <laughs> I'm speaking highly of us, but... <laughs> I think that that's about all there is to say. 
Thank you very much for watching, and I hope that you enjoyed Bloodborne.